Hey guys and welcome to another exciting Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to use the corner pin, tutorial, corner pin effect and how to get the best results out of it. Let's get into it. <laughs> So before I start off this video guys, I just want to say a big thank you to the guys who subscribed already to my channel. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, please guys, go down there into the, into the description and click subscribe, please guys, it really, really helps me. Turn on post notifications, like, comment, do all the stuff you guys like to do there. Um, it really helps me, I enjoy making these videos for you, and um, I really, really appreciate it if you do that. Anyway, let's get on with the video. So the first thing you're going to need to have is a picture of... Uh, your computer screen, your phone screen, um, or even your TV. And then what you need is a video or another photo that you want to superimpose or place in the screen of your video. So you're going to drag that video onto the layer above your photo. We can delete the audio because we don't really need it for this tutorial. However, when you do your, t your videos, you might need to use it. Now this effect is really, really awesome to make your videos a bit different. Um, you could be sitting in a coffee lounge or in your friend's house and instead of the sport playing on the TV, you could have your vlog playing on the TV or your travel video, whatever you want. You could have conversations with yourself on the screen. It's really, really an awesome effect to use. Um, now, just to make sure, you guys, you guys must make sure that your image is the same length as your video. Otherwise, there is, there's going to be a little bit of an overlap for the video. Okay, so the next thing we're going to need to do now is make sure you have your video selected. You're going to go up to the effects control panel and you're going to go down to scale and position. You're going to scale and position this in the center of the screen and try get it as close to the corners as possible. So about there. Now the next thing we're going to do is, um, so once you've got that in the middle there, you can either click on the effects tab up here or go down to the two arrows in the bottom corner here, click on them and select effects. Um, now once you're here, you're going to want to search for an effect called corner pin. It should be under video effects, under distort, and you can take corner pin and drag it and drop it on your video. Now this little FX sign over here will go green once you have your effect on, that just means the clip has an effect. So select your video clip again, go to the effects control panel, and make sure to click on corner pin. You'll see four blue um, circles around the corners of your videos. Now this is what you need to drag to the corner of your screen to superimpose and to manipulate the edges of your, of your um, video. So for this I like to go into a 50% view, so it's really really close up. And you're going to go to the corner, uh, let's find it, and you're going to drag it to the corner of your computer screen. Now this effect is quite a big effect, that's why it does uh, lag your computer unless you have a very fast computer. Uh, I'm sorry about not getting the video out yesterday, uh, that's mainly because uh, my computer was lagging with the effect. Anyway, so I'm going to speed up the video here, all you've got to do is drag all four blue dots to all four corners and then I'll check back with you after I've done that. Let's go. <music> Okay guys, so once you have got all four corners onto your screen, you'll have quite an interesting effect here. You'll see that the video actually looks like it's playing from your, your computer or your phone or your TV. Now, um, this, 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 this effect, you can, you can use it on anything you guys want. Um, I, I, I recommend using it on your phone, computer and TV. Um, I do have a picture here of a TV like that and then a picture of a cell phone like that and it's quite interesting because you can actually do uh, tutorials like this like let's say you want to do like the tutorial I'm doing to you now um, you could put that on a computer screen or if you want to do a Lightroom mobile tutorial on your phone you can put a screen recording of you editing your photo on your phone which is just a picture and actually looks really really awesome um, Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video, please please subscribe guys, hit the big subscribe button, turn on the notifications, join the crew, um, I'm going to be doing a lot more tutorials like this, let me know in the description below, I mean in the comments below if you guys would like any more tutorials, in the description is my Instagram link, uh, please go and follow me there, um, I also have a couple of other tutorials in the description below, um, and it's these little effects that make such a big difference to your videos, um, yeah guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed, um, let me know if you need anything done for you guys. And guys, just remember, never stop creating.